Howdy folks, welcome to a new series for the channel. This is Once Human. Uh, this game has got a lot of attention lately. A lot of, maybe, I guess, mixed attention, I guess, is the best way to describe this. Uh, some of the things that it likes, it has had people do, like, in terms of uh, government IDs for uh, creating your accounts and stuff on here. Um, but I figured, you know, we are a very survival game dominated channel. Um, I'm not going to go on this. I'm just going to go on uh, single player world. Uh, I can do a single player world. I'm sure I can. I saw it showing somewhere. Eternal Land. That might be the single player. So I'm, I'm on the demo at the moment. I haven't bought the full game. Um, so I'm just kind of jumping into a thing to see what's, uh, you know, what's the thing, I guess. What's, uh, what's the crack um, with the game? Um... Alright, we'll go with this, because we don't know what we're doing yet, so we'll see how it goes. The game looks very pretty, and I've seen a lot of, like, fun stuff for, um, from a building aspect. And you guys know how much I love a building game. Privacy policy, yes, we'll confirm to it. Uh, server, players in Q67. Tweeted 08, what? Okay, so I've got a bit of a wait. Alright, I'll jump you guys back in once we're actually in the game then, okay? Bear with me. Flies to wanton boys are we to the gods. They kill us for their sport. Okay, folks. To what's human? The opening. Our lives have followed a long path. Oh. Have they now? But eventually, all roads reach their end. Okie dokie. That's cool. My world is broken, stagnant, fallen into the abyss. Very pretty game. But everything what is born from that? darkness. Even the universe itself. Spark of life still burns, and evolution forges a new way forward. Ooh. Once your faith overcomes despair, once you move beyond death. Once Ooh, life death. returns to this world. We'll meet beyond that path. Okie dokie. Well, this is cool. Very pretty. Very pretty. Uh, I was looking at unlocking a new accessory. You can equip it via the weapon customization screen. Awesome times. What are the things we got here? Uh, storage crates. You can't keep everything in your backpack. Try placing a crate in your territory and using it to store less valuable items. Ooh, that is creepy. These are weird. That's cool. Man, I'm looking forward to this. Uh, make sure to search wilderness strongholds thoroughly. They're the best places to find resources. Okay, I feel like we have to gear up to that though, right? Um, what else we got? Eternal land. When a new season starts, you can use logistic points to transfer supplies from the space time backpack to the season backpack. Okay, so eternal. All right, that's oh, okay. All right, cool. I'm down for that. I'm down for. I'm looking forward to this. Like I said, I've I've seen some cool. That is cool. Weird. Creepy, but cool. Vehicle tires will automatically repair themselves after being completely destroyed. Okay. Uh, Warband members must work together to build a stronghold. Donate supplies to earn contribution, which can be exchanged for items in the Warband shop. Man, there's a lot to do with this game, I think. So, we need to form a Warband, is what I'm saying. Okay, if you are playing this game, you're just about to get on this game or something like that, and you fancy joining in a world together... Um, I do have G Portal servers. I use them quite a lot, and I'm more than happy to start our own one if we fancy, because this looks like it could be rather big. 
rather be. It can certainly take its time loading, you know? I mean, there's only so long I can store for. Um, hives are the most cohesive groups in the wilderness. They are formed in the spirit of mutual aid and improvement. Does that, can we form a hive? While encountering adverse weather conditions, watch out for low visibility and poor hearing. Human beings will always compete for power, food, and resources. The union is no exception. Okay. Oh, here we go. That's good timing. Uh, I appear to not have a chest, though. There we go. There's my chest. Uh, I like that hair. I know this is done on Unreal Age of 5 as well, so that... Ooh, quite weird. Strange. What are we feeling? I kind of like that. Eh, no, I'm not. Um, there? Eh. 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 I just want something basic to work from for a little bit, just so we can try it. Oh, we're just going to go with that. We're going to go... No, we're not. We're going to go with that. Um, Name character. Uh, Complete character creation. What other bits are there? Face, hair. I'm not going to... Yeah, we're not going to bother with the whole thing for this one. I mean, it looks like there's a lot of stuff for it, which is great. Um, But I kind of want to... Uh, cheesy. Cheesy. Uh... I mean, that looks like nice at times. That one. Absolutely that one. End of the game. Let's go for it, baby. Let's see what this world's got to offer us. Chaotic court. Okay, right. Here we go. I thought I already did this. I already did this. What the hell, man? Am I doing loading again? What? I'll jump you guys back here once I should get into the game. Because this is... Are you serious now? Oh, that's ridiculous. I'll jump you guys back in. Welcome back, folks. Okay. I, um... I've, I've had to, as you may guess. I've had to, uh... Tweak settings down. All bones are broken. No signs of life. Uh, no. Subjects adult, human, ethnicity, blank, gender, blank, identity, unknown. Subject's body has been in a state of stasis ever since being recovered from blank, following blank. The cause for reappearance is still unknown. Well, that's really told me a lot. So happy. I'm so happy you told me that. I wish I could, I could loot the body. I looted a bag. So I've got some stuff. Um, although I do appear to still be quite naked. Um, or my buns. I've got a great ass. That's like just a pert little butt, isn't it? I'm just saying. Uh, examine the lab and find the password. Okay. Can you do anything else with you? I don't think so. Oh, it's over there. Investigate. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Uh, today's code for D23 experiment is 028. The code has been updated by Supervisor Jing. 0728. Okay, I don't know if this is one of those games where I actually have to... Oh, no, it's, it's displayed in the top left. That's really nice. Thank you very much, game. I appreciate you for doing that. That's very helpful for a mind like mine where I just don't care too much about, like, or remember things, and I go, oh, what's that? Shiny thing. 0728. Password correct. Awesome things. People appear to be dead, though. Can I take some of those? Uh, interact with the researcher. An intact cradle was recovered near subject A073 with a design and manufacture consistent with those used by the mayflies. Energy stored within the cradle shows unusual signs of activity and seems to be more volatile when near subject A073. The cradle has been placed in a separate room for safekeeping until more research can be conducted. Ooh. I have... Where did I get that from? Am I subject A073? Ooh. Okay. That looks like me, right? Or not?
What the fuck is this? This is odd. Talk to the strange bird. Well, it's good to see another face. I thought I was on my own. And you're right. a human too. Okay, am I? What did you just call me? You awakened the cradle. And that's something only a metahuman could do. You've lost okay. memory. Do you remember who you... Not really, no. That pretty eyes. It must have been that fluctuation just now. It trapped me in the cradle. It could have robbed you of your memories. You could it now. can call me V. It Thanks. seems that our interests are aligned, metahuman. Well, what are your interests? Uh, but you're a talking bird. Where are we? This place seems kind of dangerous. This place is called a monolith. Rosetta uses this place to secure deviations and perform experiments on them. Okay. I wasn't expecting this many deviants, though. I am pretty deviant, to be fair. That's that's accurate. True. I used to be like you once, a metahuman. Okay. But it's a long story. Am I gonna end up like a bird? I came to secure a deviation, a paper butterfly. But I think something must have scared. Right now, though, we need to move. I can show you the way out, but only if you help me complete my. All you have to do is listen to. Okay, seems fair. Oh, okay. Uh, just walk through that. Like, just no. Okay, fine. Let's go for it. Yeah, dude, this place is this game is just strange. Uh, weapon crate, okay. Uh, explore the monolith, uh, optional press Q to use space time to search for items in the monolith, okay. Take that, press Q. Okay, I mean, that's gonna be for the door, so I don't really want to do that. Stardust. It's called a deviant. Right. Our world has been overrun with deviants ever since Starfall. Ordinary humans can't take high levels of Stardust exposure. When they do, they end up just like that thing. But you're a metahuman. You should be fine. In fact, if the conditions are right, you might even be able to use Stardust to your advantage. Oh, yeah. Sounds good to me, I guess. Uh, okay, cool. Yeah, good. Let's go for it. I, I mean, the hat is nice, but I feel like it's a little bit. I, I wanna. I, why would I wanna cover my hair? My hair is bright red. Like a key feature of me. Well, that's cool. All right, the combat's fun. A no. no. That doesn't feel right saying that. Can I sneak? Try to backstab thing, that's cool. That is very cool. I, I may have to adjust the form so the game down even lower than it currently is. But, um, you know, at least it's working. So that is something. Notes can be found scattered throughout the world. Okay, uh, this is Priority Alpha research operation. Any findings report ready for Project Butterfly? Okay, cool things. Cool beans, bro. Cool beans. You looking my way? Now he is. Thank you. Take this. Search this. 
Did you put the hat on by... Oh, you put the hat on already. Didn't like that. And the shoes. See, that's more stompy. I don't like it. Feels nice, though. It feels like a really nice game. And for, like, little loot goblins like me, you know, there's plenty of stuff to get through. But, I mean, I know it's early, don't get me wrong. And I know we're nowhere near it. But, like, I'm looking forward to, you know, being a loot goblin in one of these strongholds. That sounds cool. Uh, who the hell is that? Cool. Can I open this? Because there is stuff on the other side of that door. Isn't there? How do I get that? Should I go back the other way? What's that? I, I want to just... I just want to explore... I make sure I explored everything. So if I go this way... I go through there... Yeah. I want the... I want the items. Alright. I... Like I said, loot goblin, I have to do it. It's, it's part of my being. Hi. How are you? After image. Oh, I'm touching it. Okay. The fuck is that? Blueprint improvements can be found. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, mystical crates out in the wilderness. Collect enough fragments and you'll be able to craft the weapon yourself. Beautiful things. Amazing job. Everything looks topsy turvy. This is going to be interesting. It's going to be cool, man. Like we've done post-apocalyptic. We've done zombie. This is something else. Something different. Just once, just once a survival game. Ah, uh, no. Uh, hey. Spatial theater. Often the course of anomalies in time, allowing past scenes to be witnessed again. Activate space time to locate spatial theaters. What's your name? Don't know. All I know is that I'm a monster. My mother. Okay. My father. And everyone else. They're gone. And it was all my fault. Hey, Why? Try and stay calm. I'm here. And I will do everything to help. It's no use. He seems like a nice guy. No one can help me. I can't do that. And you're not a monster. In fact, you're very, very special. You just need to learn how to control your power. Once you do that, you can help fix this broken world. We can do that together. Hey. My butterfly, it's flying. Yes, your first deviation. And look how gentle it is. I remember my name now. It's Mitsuko. It means child of light. It's my first creation. I will create more. Hi, dude. I can't seem to go in there. Ooh, power attack. Can I go in there? Well, then, why can I go in this one? I can't go in the other one. Okay, one second. I, I mean, I've got to be able to go through there, don't I? There's a little weird, like, barrier in front of it. Now he's moved over there as well. That's okay. Can I go in there? Oh, oh, shit! Okay. Did I manage to somehow jump? Oh, no, there, there's, there's a floor. Okay. I thought I somehow managed to jump across. Like, you guys know I'm not that good. 
at jumping cheer. Nothing in the med kit. There's nothing else in here. That's fine. Okay, cool. I probably have to go through that doorway after I've done the space time, don't I? That's probably what it is. secure other deviations we can use them to forge a new path and bring about true evolution this will be the mayfly's mission this is why we'll fight mayflies that's right mayflies small yet invincible humanity may seem puny now but we'll prove we can endure cool 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 good to have goals good to have positivity completely happy with that you're good to see it. You love to see it. Sneak up behind this guy and and just do the the backy stab thing. Are you a Nasher as well, Anora? Handling briefcase. Ooh. Uh, fire or throw. Oh! It's a ranged weapon itself. Where'd that fucker come from? That is cool. That's very cool. I like that. Rustic gloves. And I just look kind of strange. I'm not gonna lie. Like with the with the gloves, the hat, the you know. The deviation. We found it. Reach out your left hand. See if you can feel the rhythm of it. Then try and secure it. That is Matey Boy's voice, isn't it? That's the guy who was talking to her, right? Is it meant to be sound very similar or is it just a is that just me? Hello Mitsuko! Come on, play the cutscene, okay? Oh, come on. There you go. Well done. Hmm. Kill Cortex is carrying moon cause a Players are in a chaotic state. Chaos players are unable to teleport. They must travel. What the fudge? Goddamn. Enter Victor Hamlet's territory. I don't know if it's. You're a real person? Hi. You made it back. You're still alive. Yes, and look what I found. A meta, only just woken up. Yeah. They were kind enough to activate the cradle and set me free. Yeah. Thank you, meta human. Your help means a lot to me. You can call me Mitsuko. Mitsuko, sorry, I I'll keep calling Mitsuko. As well. It is Mitsuko. Did all kinds of experiments Mitsuko. on me. That is, until V saved me. Mitsuko is a very special meta. She can sense even the tiniest fluctuations in the stardust. Ah. It's thanks to her that I was able to take refuge in this place after Starfall. You're safe here. Right. What's Starfall? About 20 years ago, Rosetta triggered a major stardust fluctuation during one of their experiments. Right. As a result, some great ones slipped through, entering into our world. Deviations. They brought increased levels of stardust with them. That poison has seeped into every corner of our world now, spawning countless deviants and other dangers. Definitely thought that said shenanigans, but you know, it might be just me. Uh, so we all used to be Rosetta test subjects? That's what Rosetta does. At first, they just locked deviations away. But then they figured...
figured out the deviations, that's when they commenced their experiments. In the name of human progress. Right. As a result, they created metahumans, like me and you. Well, that's very naughty. Rosetta, we are the future. It is our potential to harness stardust that they value above everything else. It's all they care about. And they're not wrong. Metahumans are mankind's last hope. We were created by Rosetta, but we don't take orders from them anymore. Okay. Yes, the butterfly is an emissary of sorts. I wanted it to help rescue other metas. The recent fluctuation must have startled it. The important thing right now is to secure it. See that thing in the center of the room? It's a device for securing deviations. This makes them more useful and safer to be around. So capturing deviations is going to be a good thing that I do, right? The butterfly is recovered. I think it likes That's you. That's cool. What makes you think it likes me? Learn more about... I just kind of want to just get into the game a bit. Deviations can be very dangerous if not taken care of. They can radiate stardust, which can lead to all kinds of unpredictable consequences. Okay. This is why we created the Mayflies. We make cradles and securement units to keep deviations. Okay. We're finding ways for humans and deviations to live in harmony. This cool. is our best chance of cleaning up Rosetta's mess. Right. No one's exactly sure what they are. Just that they're not bound by the physical laws of our world. Right. They came from another dimension. Something we call rift space. When deviations get stressed, they release stardust. We think this brings our world and rift space closer together. Cool. Sometimes it becomes possible to pass between the two planes of existence. And when that right. happens, all hell breaks loose. Okay. Some deviations are friendly, like the butterfly. But others, like the ones inside monoliths, are extremely dangerous. Yeah, well, it's I mean, you say they're dangerous. Them. They're extremely. But if we can learn more about them, maybe we can find ways to live alongside them. That's the goal. You must be prepared. The stardust just keeps... Spine-chilling roar. Be careful. That must be a siren. Shit, it must have gotten through. Come on, Meta. A deviation from another world just entered this space. And take the butterfly with you. It can. Can I have a gun? Ooh, wait a minute, maybe I can. Uh, arrows. Doesn't mean there's a bow knocking around, right? Not really gonna read that right now. Uh, withdraw. Uh, be a bow in here, please. Metal scraps and stuff. Uh, synchronized butterflies emissary for cradle. What does that mean? Interact with isolated securement unit to view the. Okay, so I didn't do that. Right, so do this. Do that. Uh, use facility. Uh, awesome. Okay, uh, sync to cradle. Uh, yeah, combat deviations. Control deviations. Carry the dormancy threshold of a combat deviation cannot be uh, adjusted and defaults to 100 when deviant power is fully recovered. When blah 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 blah. Okay, cool. Good times. Right. So then, what do I do? Optional. Collect dirty water. Use pickaxe. Gather wood. The stuff. Okay. Is there stuff upstairs? Apparently not. Oh, there's med bag there though. Didn't check that. Right. Okay. Um, I know this one's going to be short. Um, oh, it's in my backpack. Oh, it's linked to my backpack. That's I like that. That's cool. That's pretty. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, sorry. Like I said, um, we are going to end this one here. Um, I know this one's short, and I know there's a bunch of tutorial stuff to come. Um, but like, if we're going to do a thing for this, then we're going to do a thing for this properly, and I don't want to be, you know, blitzing through it. Um... I need to make war. Collect dirty water. You are hungry. Reduce load. Ma okay. Do I have any food? What does the backpack look like? How do I get the backpack up? I? Is it I? 
in this, we've got... Okay, you're gonna... You're gonna be glitchy because this is the first time I've opened it, isn't it? You are, yeah. Um, canned lunch meat, boiled water, sanity gummy, flatbread. Well, that's probably a good one to eat, right? I didn't look like it did what I wanted to do. Yeah, not so much. Uh, right, okay. Um, yeah, like I said, sorry, I'm going to drop, I'm going to uh, em uh, empty, uh, end this one off here. Your hunger's been eased, load restored, max HP increase. Okay, that's cool. Uh, yeah, I'm going to end this one here. I'm going to um, grab some bits and bobs in between now and next episode to uh, get the kind of basics done, like grab a, get a pickaxe, get an axe, uh, maybe can let some dirty water in the meantime. Um, just so you guys don't have to necessarily sit through that stuff quite as long as I would potentially have to do it. You know what I'm saying? Um, manage generator. Power use 20 maximum outputs. Okay. This place does have a lot. It's got a lot of stuff then. You've left Victor's. Okay. Cool. Right. Anyway. Uh, thank you. Have a great day. Have a great night. Whatever time zone you want in. Stay happy. Stay positive. Stay cheesy. Lots of love. And I will see you guys again very soon. If you do want to join in for a thing with, with me, uh, for once human, um, I'm... Definitely up for that. It seems like a really cool game. It seems like a really... What's E? I don't know. It's just got E on my, next to my machete. And I thought it was a thing. Oh, that's the back. That's the butterfly, isn't it? I thought it was an axe head. Sorry. Um, yeah. Have a great day. If you did enjoy this, please let me know in the comments below. If you want to join in, again, comments below. Um, but subscribe if you haven't already. Um, and I'll see you guys again very soon. Catch you later. Bye-bye.